Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Dear viewers, we are going for next part. Here, we don't want to see this grid views, so we will go to display setting. Seeing here grid, this turn up. Okay. Now we will add a story. We will see the elevation here. We are now in this floor level. We have to add this level one, level two. First, we will add level one, then level two. Now go to a story here. Insert a story. Here we have to provide total number of story. Here already we have one story. So here if we write one, then it will not add any story. So here we have to write two. So existing one and then another one will add because here written total number of stories. So click on OK. Now one story added. Now click on this story. After clicking on this story, then only you can generate the story because in story one there is the element. Click generate story here. Now target story this one. Here what we can do, we can uh, select all and click OK. Then we can delete retaining all. But this is better to unmark here wall but here we see there is a share all also if we unmark this wall then share all also will not be replicated so we will try with this one later on we will replicate share all so click on ok close now here we can see the share all not replicated so what we can do this 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 for wall now generate story target this selected members only click on ok now done so this is the way to replicate our preferable members for next floor now this is the floor here we need to edit some things because here there is no retaining wall so in periphery we need to add beams so go to plan view level 2 plan view this one now this can deliver we can delete we will take full slab so here first we will add beam default 400 by 800 ok select like this now from here to here okay now we will add slab here here also we need beam like this and here we will delete this column now go to slab load here previous load as well as previous load select like this this is done now for new beam we will apply our load now this one from here copy beam wall load then paste copy beam load yes yes
yes now we can see in 3d view here this is our wall load now this floor we can replicate to level 2 in level 2 this is 3.6 meter so insert history here now total number will be 3 to add one extra history yes now here select story 2 then go to story generate story target story this one click on ok now this story added to level 2 in level 2 there is cantilever part from here to here 4 meter so this last grid go to slab here type will be cantilever cantilever length 4000 millimeter from here to here then select like this so this is the cantilever you can go to 3d view now here we can edit history height because this story is 3.6 meter go to building set out edit history here 36.00 ok click on ok yes now here in cantilever portion if we want to apply wall load we can go to plan for that we can add extra window here go to scene setting grid ok now this is plan view and here this is 3d view now we will draw our wall load line load 10 kN per meter from here to here from here to here and from here to here in 3d view we can see the line load now we can add two story additional these two level 3 and level 4 with cantilever portion now go to building go to level 3 here insert story now total number of story will be 5 because existing 3 and new 2 so total 5 yes now this one generate history target history 4 and 5 close now here in cantilever portion there will be no wall only there may be railing so for railing we can edit this load properties to update then close now select this one properties this to update and close and properties to update and close now if we want to check the value here g 2 kN per meter here also you can see 2 kN per meter but down here 10 here 10 ok so this is our model up to level 4 we can go up to level 5 here without cantilever portion and this side ok so go to 
insert story now here will be six click on ok yes now here click on five insert story sorry generate story target is six done now here in level six plan select here level six this is the level six here we will delete delete this can deliver and this side we will have the area up to this line so this four grid one two three four four span will be deleted so here up to four and we deleted and this portion also delete axis okay one two three four now here we can edit this loads because here we can delete we more load yes select one wall copy we more load okay select here then all this area test yes so load will be deleted as we have copied zero load yes now here we can add wall height will be 1 meter for periphery wall thickness 0.2 click on ok now this one copy beam wall load then select these beams paste yes so now we can see this area will have only parapet wall load and here we can add we can copy this one copy and paste wall load now this is our level 5 this is our level 5 level 5 to level 15 we can replicate history and this column will be inclined so in the next tutorial we will model level 6 to 15 with inclined columns so till then stay tuned and press like button if you like the tutorial and share with your engineering colleagues and friends press the bell icon on the youtube app and never miss another update